Hello folks, Bronco Bob here with Texas Best Used Motorcycles in Mansfield, Texas. And we will trade for just about anything and this kind of proves it. We've got a, a Sooner 4 horse living quarters trailer. It's a 2000 model and we're not really in the trailer business so we're going to sell this as is. It needs a few repairs and I'm going to show you kind of what it needs. But it represents a great value for a weekender horse trailer. You can carry up to four horses. The living quarters will sleep uh, up to four people if two of the people are kind of little people. It does have a fresh set of Kumho uh, heavy duty weight rated tires with a lot of tread. They're in good shape, they're not cracked. Um, it does have the living quarters on the inside. This right here folds out into a, to a bed. Then you got the big queen size bed up front with the cabinets. Uh, it's got air conditioning, roof air. Got nice oak faced cabinets. It's carpeted up here in the front. It's got a TV stand, but there's no TV. It'd look good with a flat screen. It's got a microwave. It's got a cooktop that looks like it hasn't been used. The sink's very clean. It's got a, a propane and electric powered refrigerator. The hole you see in the floor is a mount for the table and you got the pedestal and the table right here. This also has a Generac generator. It looks like 659 hours on the generator. Most of these weekenders don't have generators, so that's kind of a big plus. Uh, it's got a full bathroom, vanity, commode, and a stand-up shower. I'm going to go out here and show you the, the outside. It does need some work, and I'm going to show you what I see that it needs. It looks like it had a blowout at one time. You can see a dent right here on the rear fender. And then the, the panel right here, you can see where the trailer's been drugged. Uh, maybe they got in a low area. The aluminum on the side is scraped. Not really scraped, but it's rubbed from like chains hanging off of it. Um, the generator's mounted up on the roof. There's a place here in the back where the corner, the aluminum, little piece of aluminum's missing, this hinge needs to be replaced. I did talk to Sooner, they're $26 for those aluminum hinges. So it just needs to have some of the correct hardware put on it. You can see they've put different bolts in it. Just kind of needs some love. The little door stay is missing that goes right here. But most of these are three horse trailers. This is a four horse. It's got a place for four saddles, uh, tack room. And then you got your your stalls with mangers. There's three mangers. The front stall does not have a manger. It's got rubber mats on the floor. It's got hooks to hang your stuff. The lights don't seem to work in the back. I don't know if it's a fuse, but that's, that's again something else that needs to be done uh, maintenance wise. This side of the trailer is in good shape. Again, has rub marks uh, right there from maybe horse bridles, I'm not sure. You can see on the bottom where They've gone through a low place and drug it. It's missing a light here on the back. Uh, the tires and wheels, you can see here, are in very good shape. Um, this is missing a piece of glass right here. Another thing that just needs some maintenance. There's a dent right here. And this uh, little door doesn't really latch properly. So it needs a little, a little love. Uh, we couldn't really check it out. I couldn't get the generator to start. I did get it to turn over um, And it's missing the plug Or the cable to plug it in so I couldn't really check out the AC or the heat or refrigerator uh, Does have two, two propane tanks uh, the batteries up here in the front and a spare tire and The best I can tell it's 33 feet long. It's aluminum and steel construction the decals are kind of faded out a little bit, but like I say, we're a motorcycle dealer. We're not a, a horse trailer dealer. I had somebody ask me the length of the short wall, so I guess this would be the short wall. It looks like it's about eight feet or maybe nine feet. 
but I can put a tape on it and get the specs. If you look up Sooner Royale Four Horse Living Quarters, should have all the specs on it. But again, if you got any questions, give us a call. If you're looking for a, a four horse trailer, you don't mind doing a little bit of work, and you want to end up with a living quarters as well as a generator, this is probably a really good deal for somebody. We took it in. As I say, we'll trade for anything, and we, we just like to get our money back out of it. I know these new, some of them are upwards of fifty or sixty thousand dollars if you take this one oh i want to show you something else on the inside this door to the closet is broken all that remains is this portion but the the actual door is missing i can't get the lights to work back here like it's almost like there's no power to the to this section where the bathroom is it does have a separate large shower that you can stand up in and a separate commode. I know some of these horse trailers, they combine the commode and the shower together to save space. But the rest of the cabinets are in really good shape. It's reasonably clean. Um, I noticed a few spots on the carpet back here. Maybe somebody spilled some coffee. Uh, there's a grill missing from the speaker. Again, it's all just kind of minor stuff. But if you don't mind fixing stuff up... You might even be able to buy this trailer, make it 100% and flip it and make some money. But thanks for looking. Thanks for your time. The first cash takes it. Uh, we just need to get it sold. Have a great day. This is Bronco Bob wishing you happy trails.